Hello, and what is up, YouTube? Cliff B here, and once again, playing Scrap Mechanic on this um, build showcase. I made a horse drawn and carriage. Look at this. As you can see, it is absolutely flawless. It's got decorated lights on it, it's got like proper coach doors, seating for four. And you do have to crash down to get in. A radio, you know, those newfangled things, so you can listen to some tunes. Just in case you don't want to listen to the majestic galloping of horses, because it is a two horse drawn carriage. And, you know, that's understandable. Or the hustle and bustle of the city, because no rich person should deal with the hustle and bustle of the city. As you can see, we get in the seat, we close the doors, also got a trunk. Uh. You know, for luggage. And. You know, let's just go. Let's turn on the tunes. As you can see, look at that turning there. These majestic horses are clearly the best. Oh, uh, one minute. As you can see, not many carriages can go in reverse, but this one can. Thanks to these horses' amazing backward walking ability. And let's turn around, and let's just take them to that far platform over there, shall we? So we're just going to pretend there's like some people in there. Or you know what, we're going to pick up the people. As you can see, these amazing horses have so much like, foot power when they stomp, that they actually like, defy gravity, and just keep going, you know? It's just amazing. As you can see, climb hills, no problems whatsoever. And you know what? Just for a little bit of entertainment. Gotta have the horses go this way real quick. And we're gonna do a jump. Cause that's gonna be awesome. Oh yeah, it's coming. It's coming. It... Oh crappy doodle. Um horses help. Luckily Yeah. Thanks to my using horsepower these horses. Which is two. Because there's two horses, therefore horsepower is two. But thanks to major horsepower of these horses, you know, as you can see, we're selling along. And I do have to say, this is an amazing looking carriage. Like, no offense, I would just probably, like, you know, pay however much a carriage was back in the day for one of these carriages. Look at these horses. So majestic on how they do things. As you can tell, they're just the finest breed. Like, look at that brown coat. They're obviously Mustangs. And who wouldn't want that carriage drawn by Mustangs? Oh. Horses, no. We want to go straight, not that way. Where are you going, ho horses? Straight. Uh, these horses may need a little bit of training, but... You know... They still get the job done nicely, and we are here at platform number four. So let's get the horses a break. Let's open a door for these guys, and let's turn off the radio, because, you know, we have arrived at the destination, and they can, most likely won't hear me over the radio, and it's impolite to yell at the rich, you know? You don't yell at the rich. <laughs> so, yeah, we can go in, have to crouch, but, you know, you always crouch to get into a carriage. I mean, I could just make this one wide opener, but no, no, no. So, you know, let them know we're at our destination, they can get off, so you can just back your way out the door here. Then, unfortunately, you have to do open the trunk. I mean, you have to open the trunk from the driver's seat because everything's automatic, so you can just open the trunk from the driver's seat, let them get their stuff, then close the trunk after they got in their stuff, and uh, close the door. Everything's controlled by the driver's seat because of oh, new fangle technology. And you know, once they're off at their destination, you just go on your merry way. And when they call to come for you to come pick them up, you come pick them up. But as you see, clearly, this is just an amazing, amazing carriage. Like, I'm pretty sure if this was back in the day, this would be a Bentley quality carriage. I mean, it's made out of 100% Bentley quality wood. It's amazing. So, yeah, guys, that's all I wanted to show for this build showcase was this amazing carriage. Let's get a bit of music because these horses are... 
Yeah, well, their noise drives me insane as well. So a little bit of music to cover it up. Look at them galloping in the wind, like majestic steeds, just absolutely perfect galloping. As they somehow make their way across this terrain on a slope without sliding. Because these, these are just the finest breed of horses, aren't they? They're lovely horses. Totally along an amazing carriage. But yeah, guys. So that's pretty much all I want to show um, show for this build showcase with this horse drawn catch. So let's park it up here and I can show you the the connections about how this all works. I mean, I know many of you have never seen like um, horses before because horses are a rare breed. Well, not so many rare, but it's not a sight you see in the wilds. But as you can see, there's horses here. As you can see, this horse is here, and they're using like new founded um, rubber horse shoes because you know putting nails in horses' feet just sounds brutal, and I didn't want to do something that brutal, so you know these new rubber ones just slip right on, and this is how the whole entire thing turns. And of course we have like four wheels in the back here because, you know, trying to force horses to push a sled around is kind of brutal. And you know, we at this, I don't know, horse-drawn carriage service place of something fancy something, don't improve of brutality towards animals. So I can see that the radio in there, just playing some tunes right now, there's some lights. Which trust me, they totally make everything brighter. And if we go right here, and we just open a trunk. Get a little bit stuck trying to get out the vehicle. We come to the back, as you can see, some of these fancy lads has forgotten their luggage. Look at these giant suitcases. And briefcases. And whatnot. But, yeah. So we're gonna have to go back and deliver their luggage. Once they call us to come back. They're invisible, that's why you can't see them, because, you know, the poor can't see the rich. It'll be too blinding for our eyes. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, if you like this, please be sure to like and subscribe to support this series in the channel. I am Cliff B, and I am signing out as I ride off into the majestic sunset with... Ride off into majestic sunset with my steez gathering. I am Cliff B, and I am signing out. Bye, YouTube.